everyone welcome back to my channel so as you can see I'm bare face and today I'll be doing a first impressions uh, review of the new product I received this is the matcha products from the matcha the matcha reserve so I got these two masks to try out sorry look that way and um, yeah, so I got these two masks to try out. So this one's the matcha mud mask. And this one is supposed to be... And this one is supposed to be a deep skin cleanser. Um, it helps with... It's an anti-acne, pore reducer, oil control, and anti-aging. And then this other one, it's the oxygen matcha mask. It's deep cleansing, hydrating, purifying, parabens, and sulfate free. This one is the oxygen one. So, for the matcha mud mask, it says 100% natural, parabens, and sulfate free. This matcha mud mask penetrates deep into your skin surface to visibly reduce the appearance of fine lines and wrinkles, leaving your skin moisturized and healthy. Um, formula minimizes your pore size, removes toxins, rejuvenates cells while supplying your skin with mineral elements, vitamins, and antioxidants. All right, I'm gonna open up so you guys can see how it looks. So it's like that. Matcha mask, I did try this one out, I wanna say two, three days ago in the shower. So I hop into the tub, had a nice relaxing um, bath. And then I put this on and I really enjoyed this one, but I wanna try it again one more time to give you guys a, a better review on it. For this okay. one will be pretty much a first impressions. So this one, it's like this. If you guys can see, you can see moving, it's very liquidy, this one. I read in the back to the information. So it says this bubble mask with matcha generates oxygen bubbles that remove toxins dead skin cells and sebum to hydrate and deeply clean your skin. Delivering extra oxygen to your skin boosts the production of collagen, making you look younger, plumber, and less wrinkled. And it also says oxygen and matcha are also an amazing dual skin acne causing bacteria to calm breakouts. As for breakouts, I don't really have um, like once in a while I have uh, like some around my nose here underneath my nostrils or on my chin but it's really once in a blue moon I don't thank god I don't suffer from like really bad acne also I hope you guys are enjoying this new background I tried to change a little bit so it's not always showing my closet for you guys but yeah so this is where I do my makeup it's my big mirror my brushes all there and then um let me try to show them to push down and that's just where my makeup storage is like all the drawers and there's some on the other side too okay so I'm gonna first do this one since I haven't tried really tried this one so I'm gonna do the oxygen mask first I'm gonna apply it to my face my for face. 10 to 15 minutes until the mask bubbles then rinse with warm water repeat two to three times a week all right so I'm going to apply this to my face. So I usually use um, something like this. It's like a rubbery um, tip to apply masks. Um, this one is very liquidy. So I'm not sure how this is going to really work. Oh, I guess it caught nicely. So I'm going to just apply like that. And then after I'm going to use my hands too because I feel like this spatula kind of is so liquidy. It kind of takes a little bit off. And also matcha, it's all over, um, you know, the social media that is good for your skin, everything that has matcha or even drinking matcha tea, you know, green tea matcha. Um, so I've been trying to get products and buy products that have their matcha because I read the benefits for your health and skin. I'm just gonna spread a little bit all over because I wanna make sure that it will catch. All right, so it says to wait 10 to 15 minutes. So that's what I'm gonna do, but I can already see 
the bubbles. I don't know if you guys can tell some place spots. You can see the the lighter the difference in green. Um, see especially here. Yeah, it's getting it's bubbling. So I'm gonna wait about ten minutes and come back. Okay, so I'm back and this is how the mask <laughs> looks. I'm going to zoom in so you guys can see. All right, so it's been about ten minutes and I don't know if you guys can tell it's all like a foam bubble and then here it's still a little bit green but it has bubble all around around my nose so everywhere so I'm gonna just touch so you guys can see so it's like that foamy Sorry. so you can definitely see how foamy it gets on your skin I'm going so to rinse off with the hot um, towel and let's see Oh, it's really easy with the towel so it gets all there there you go and turn around all right okay, I think it's all off That's how my skin looks. It's feel more plump and hydrated. Um, yeah, it's, it's starting to dry a little bit, and it feels slightly tacky, very slightly. But I don't know if it's just my skin that feels plump, and then um, it's I don't know. And it gives it's also giving a nice um, hydrated look, like a, a kind of like a glow to my face. Um, yeah, I do have some redness around my cheek area, close to my nose. Um, it seems like it calmed a little bit of it. So yeah, so far, first impressions, I'm kind of impressed. So while I had the mask on for the 10 minutes, so you can it definitely feel the little bubbles um, forming and popping. I could also hear it. So it's kind of fun to see something working on your skin and it's also um, you can you feel this fullness it's not like ridiculous full like other brands have that gets really really foamy but it gets a nice foam like I showed you on my finger on your face and you can definitely feel that volume on your face um, also like a tingling feeling I think it's because of the oxygen the little bubbles forming and popping um, yeah, so it's kind of fun. I kind of like it. I really enjoyed um, having for 10 minutes and I really enjoy how it made my skin look. Um, what I'm going to do now is I want to try the other one. This is the mud mask. I'm going to try this one too right now. So while I have the other mask on, I'm going to wash this towel, make it hot, and then so it's ready to rinse out. Um, so I'm going to apply with the same tool. And this one, like I said, it, do, it is way thicker, it's not liquidy at all, it's just like a mud, you know, like a mud mask, you can see. So I'm just going to scoop off and apply to my face. So, this one's like a nice bright green. And this brush thicker. is really nice for this type of mask, the mud thicker type of masks. It's doing really nice. Go like that. Whoa! Looks really cool. Um, what I'm gonna do is just gonna check on the other mirror to see if I covered everything. Actually, I might just zoom in here. Yeah, I think it's good. So I'm using the camera as my mirror right now. All right, so this one is also the same 10 to 15 minutes. So I'm gonna give like a 10 minute mark and I'll come back and show you guys how the mask looks. I'm back, so I was gonna keep it for 10 minutes but I decided to keep it for 15 because I noticed that it wasn't really drying 
at all so I wanted to see at the full 15 minutes what was gonna happen so as I, I'm talking right now and I do feel very slightly tightness but it's still not I'm gonna zoom in it's still not dry dry it's still if I touch it well here it's not coming off anything but it's, it's a little bit sticky but it will come off in some areas so it doesn't dry completely um, doing the 15 minute mark that it says in the back 10 to 15 so yeah so I'm gonna do the same thing this is like hot so I'll do the same method to take it out with the hot towel and see how it, it will come off alright so it's coming off nicely with the towel I've been really enjoying this it's for makeup removing um, it's like that makeup eraser so other brands came out with um, their own so this one I got it came in a set of two a purple one and this pink one and I got at either Marshalls or TJ Maxx and I've been really um, enjoying these to take off makeup or um, you know for masks been really nice and I love also to do make it really hot sorry it's all the mask make it really hot and just put in your face for a few minutes like to before. do that before you exfoliate your skin or cleanse so it open up the pores so it looks really nice and soft and plump clean try to zoom a little more it does feel clean it does feel soft um, yeah the same feeling like plump it does have a shine to my face like a glow um, yeah but it's um, a little bit I want to say here on the forehead like right here on the side and forehead a little bit dry like the skin feels slightly dry to me but again after this I'm probably gonna do a serum and also a moisturizer and um, so that will take care of the dryness that I'm feeling but overall I really enjoy both masks so overall I really like these masks we'll see as I go as I use them like I said I'm gonna try to use it separate days and see how it works okay, guys, so I hope um, you guys enjoyed this mini um, first impressions and review tutorial kind of video if you guys did enjoy this, please give thumbs up. If you guys are not subscribed to my channel, if you're new to my channel, make sure you subscribe below um, or anywhere here where you're going to see my face. Um, and also, I'll put somewhere here on the screen my other social media so you guys can follow me. So thank you so much for watching and see you guys next time.